In this video, I'm going to share with you how I find some great wigs at affordable prices at Wig Studio One, just ahead. So if you follow me, you know that um, I've been thinking a lot about affordable wigs, financially accessible wigs, and the other night I started thinking, what is a good price point for me? And for me, I think that anything under $100 myself, and I'm confident many other wig wearers feel, hey, if I can get a quality wig for under $100, I'm a happy camper. So in case you're new here, my name is Angela Silver Linings, and on this channel I review silver gray white wigs, hair pieces, toppers, and other times I'll talk about the care of our natural gray hair and other beauty related topics. But because of the fact that I look for silver gray and white most of the time, um, over at Wig Studio One, I just decided, hmm, what's under $100 and what is in the silver gray white family? So as I was over here sorting, if you look uh, where they have their sort by, you can sort by A to Z, Z to A, low to high, high to low, new to old, and old to new. So what I decided to sort by was low to high. In other words, anything that I would think about purchasing would be less than $100. I didn't go over $100, I, but what I did was I looked at every single one of these wigs, every single one, and just to see if they had a wig that I liked in in silver gray or white and it took some time um, there were quite a few as you can see how many is that 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32 so you know over 40 wigs that I individually clicked on to see if they were in my color palette and of those I found this many. So there were one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and actually there were nine, but two of them as of this morning had already sold. Okay, so what I've decided to do is every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, I will come back to this page and I will once again sort low to high, and then I will just see is there anything that pops in here on this page under a hundred dollars that's new and I should be able to uh, figure that out pretty quickly uh, because all I'll do is I'll just take a screenshot and I'll compare the page where I was a couple of days ago to the new page and then I will just go into whatever the new wig is let's say it's this wig right here Penelope and I'll right click on it open it in a new tab and then see what color she's in. And in this case, she's in she's available in three colors. She's available in oh four. Creamed coffee, toasted coffee, sparkling champagne, almond green, almond breeze. None of those are in the silver gray white family, so I'm done with that one. So you can see that if I keep this page up every other day, I can pretty quickly ascertain if there's anything new in the silver gray white family. And then all of that information will get popped back into this document. That document will live on my Facebook page. The link to my Facebook page is in the show notes below. And I'm thinking about how I can also show this updated page on my YouTube channel. I may just simply take a screenshot, do a quick faceless video, and just let everybody know. There's, there are more wigs to be had over at Wig Studio One in the silver gray white family. So I hope that that makes sense. I hope it's something you find valuable. Maybe at some point Wig Studio will add um, gray, sort by the gray family up in here. That would be great. Um, I'm not sure why they don't, but I'm sure they have a good reason for it. But until then, I'll be providing this service for you. So let me know what you think in the comments. Do you like this? Um, if you have any suggestions, I'm absolutely open. I don't want this to become a full-time job. It could easily become a full-time job just looking, looking this way. 
but if I do it this way, I think within a half an hour I can update everybody generally every other day. That's it. I hope that you find value in it. If you do, hit the subscribe button below. Thanks so much for watching. Stay well. God bless everybody. Bye.